Hello there, everyone. Welcome back. I am Bogmod, where we have, uh, we have built, um, I'm gonna build two lasery deaths. We've got, we've got our new ship, the lasery death, and it is a glorious ship to be sure. The finest guns in the galaxy. Hello? Oh, you know, you can destroy my detector. There's lots of pirates out there still. Can't do much about it. Yeah, I know, I know, the pirates are a bit too much for me. But that's fine. Ooh, minus 21 a turn. Five turns, and I think I can take the Pardalis system. Which will also be when I've got my first lasery death built. Yes, and I think sent to Vicaris, I think. And from there, we can start heading towards the rest of their systems to devour them to rule them with an iron fist also speaking of ruling with an iron fist <laughs> maximized exploitation all right well hello all right so we got cerebral realities being built all right well let's build a lasery couple lasery deaths because apparently i've run out of actual normal things to build Yay, maximized exploitation. AI labor. 3D printing. Let's take a look at what my other options are for research now. Hmm. Let's see, if I took preceded, we could uh, get more, more food. Culture center. Hmm, I don't know what that kind of is implying. Gives me lots of influence. Influence election results. Uh, government diversity. Kind of curious about that. More laws. Hmm. Impactless sites would give me more production. I've got, I've got all the production I think I need right now. What are, what are my options? More manpower. More health and damage. Plus one per hull type. On empire. Mm, system improvements. That's what do we got over here? Makes my ships better. System improvement buyout. Uh, maybe we should look back down here, see if there's anything that would have been great to get. We've got hyper packs. It was a knock of new heroes. Oh, but ha yeah, ooh, plus twenty percent happiness. You know what? Infinite supermarkets. Mm. Two turns. That's easy. Mm. Is that a ship? New ship was built. Could it be my first lasery death has taken to the stars? I like to think so. The trial by fire event has ended. All right. Yes, my first lasery death. Take to the stars, my lasery death. And I'm sent to via curse. We will guard and wait for your chance. Also, oh, what's this? A shooty? Oh, okay, another shooty. Well, I'm gonna take that shooty. I'm going to send you to Pardalis. Mm. Uh, let's see. Oh. There we are. We'll merge those guys at least. And how are we doing? Minus 24. We'll do one more turn, and then I will launch my attack into Pardalis. Also, I've got botan botanical scanning. Botanical scanning complete. All right. Let's take a look at what other other options are. Xenolinguistics. 
more happiness as well as more diplomacy options. But I think it's time for it to get some trade going. Oh, wait. Detection of the four, expedition power to three, endless secrets. Let's take those two. Uh, yeah, that seems the option. Minus 11. So next turn we'll attack. And I've got my another lasery death. Which will go to Vyakers, where I'm protecting against their fleet. Side skills. Here we are. And let's see an archaeologist and theologian. Uh, join the complexity of endless runes in history. Virtual spirit deep in a lab of avoid any arc. Along with an artifact of the endless arc, and then quickly circuit deal with the clev. From the ways. Between. Interesting. Very interesting. Just reading about this. She may have been possessed by some sort of endless spirit. And we got more people! Yay! Oh, I should be keeping an eye out for. Oh, no, there they are. And there is. It seems safe up there. Karis continuing its production. Oh, here we are. Truce forced. Interesting. War lost. That give me much energy. As the victor acknowledges, there will see a total of. 46 energy for 14 turns. Interesting. Hmm. On the other hand, my... My energy reserves have grown. Perhaps it's time that I pick a new fight. Let's take one of my fleets. Send you over there. Another of my fleets. We need to explore the galaxy a little more, I think. Even as I fill myself up with lasery death. Alright, well, I'm going to set you guys. You know what? I'm going to even. You guys can just hang out in the hangar at Vyakras. Interesting. I guess they, they got some diplomacy options. They spent some stuff. Bought their way free of the war. But I was winning. But I suppose with this fleet of laser deaths coming out, they made the right move. Ooh, the ecologists. A popular sport to represent in the next election. Okay. Cool. Five. Ooh, actually, take the happiness. Laser death, all built. So let's get uh, infant supermarkets first for the happiness, and then we'll get the AI labor, and then we'll get the farming. And this is just lets me have money if I run out of things. I don't have to just churn out ships to destroy my enemies with. I mean, I don't have to. It's an option. Well, I, I, I like, I like how things have changed around. I've risen to the top of the charts I am confident I might you know maybe I'll pick a pick a war 
whom whom would be the best target? I think the Iron Fang might be. Mm. Yes. What's this? Zeon. This is my fang. And cold. I don't know what's up with that system at all. I'm curious now. Well, let's... If I'm going to send out a fleet, I'm going to need four laser deaths, I think. Also, you know what I'm going to do with my heroes now? I changed my mind about my heroes. I'm going to inspect you. It's not, it's not the best ship. Uh, on a sign? Must be opening a star system. Alright. I can f fix that once I get to find you. Or you. Send this, back to the, this fleet back to the academy vaults. Let's do that. <laughs> so. <laughs> do you think I can take him? I think I proved my military cojones. If I do fight them, I think I want to approach from the... Go to Zuyan first. Seems like that'd be the better target. Also, let's, uh... Oh, this looks like one of their fleets over here, actually. Good, I can take a little peek at it. So we've got... Oh, six ships. And a mere 151 attack. Oh, Iron Fang. Oh, you cravers. I have a feeling I'm going to utterly destroy you. So, first things first. Lasery death. Expand you. You. Into the academy. Scrap it. No. I want to... Where's my... Where's my button? There you are. I want to unassign you from your ship. And send you to manage a star system. The... Antares? Antares star system, I think. There we are. Do that with you. Laser deaths built there. Ah! No! Oh, that's the danger of clicking. It changes so quickly. So we'll get the... Build that, then that, then that. Yes, infant super records make people happy. All right, so that's done. I've got a lasery death fleet. So let's. Some command points exceed the maximum of four. How many command points do they take up? Oh, they all use individuals. All right, well, it's good to know. Guess I'll send them out separately. I guess. Mm. Let's send you there. So what? what so 151 and 284. So I'm gonna leave my. I'm gonna leave two of my lasery deaths in the system to guard. So that seems to be what I want to do, and then so diplomacy. Here we are. Uh, hi, Iron Fang. I would like to declare war on you. Start. We know little of our makers other than that they made us killing machines, and they made us well. Well, my little friend, let's see how well they made you. Law. All right. The war is underway. Oh, here we are. 
which the commercial framework technology has paved the way for developing trade routes across my empire. I need to build a trade company HQ in one of my systems. Okay. Trade company headquarters. Oh, hold on. Uh, trying to make extra dust. So many things. Building your first trade company HQ by adding it to the construction queue. Once it's built, it will form the heart of your future trade route network and hopefully make you rich. I would like to be rich. Now watch this. Opening your empire's doors to a new population types has its challenges. World's rewards. Strength and flexibility for society. Capture, simulate, or attract a new population type into my empire. Okay. Uh, the pists on speak have been assimilated by Kadem. Oops, that's not what I want. I want trading company. Do you first. Uh, oops. Guess you need more skills, my dear lady. Um. Alright, there we go. Get rid of the science boosting skill and my research. Excellent endless secrets and colonizing of snow worlds. Whee! Whee! Alright. So. You. Can I attack? Nope, can't attack. You. Can I. Oh, you can attack. Who's here? The Kadem are here, just kind of hanging out. Mm. Alright, well, I'll leave that alone for now. You can't do anything, you can't do anything, you can't do anything. What do I have here? Three lasery deaths? Alright, that sounds friendly. We'll obviously want to guard that system as well. Yeah, enemy ships will stop for a turn. Blockading them. Alright. <laughs> what a big blue sphere you got, Cetus. I like it. Here we are. With the creation of your first trade company, you've taken a big step towards some sweet import export business. Now I need to make a subsidiary company. The more systems the trade route passes through, the more profitable the route. And maybe such a severe disruption. Okay. So I guess I have to build them in these places? Book. And I guess... Terry's can have. Oh! We need to build another lizard death. We can build a trading company. AI. There we are. That'll keep you occupied. Whee! Mm. Yeah, let's take a look. Latest political survey! Alright. Most. Oh, uh, militarists and scientists. Militarists are in the lead. Interesting. So, let us attack one lasery death against this entire fleet. Let's fight. I need to I need to be able to, to build up my, my command points, though. That is a definite... Ooh, a major victory, though. Almost the complete destruction of his fleet. Followed by the complete destruction of his fleet as my second lasery death takes out his slicer. Whee! Alright, good. Keep going up that way, I think. Ooh, the plant Hekim. The Sophons of on Hekim, a rocky world working a blue star. That's my world! Lots of radiation, lots of mutation, evolution. 
Uh, though cold, lots of volcanic fish and recreate a warm spot, so I see habitable cave systems. Allowed them to indulge in study of biology and geology from early in their history. Alright. Cool. And since I've got a spare ship, I'm going to send you to join the... Uh, join efforts over there. All right, well, things are going great, I think. Just fantastic. So if I conquer Zhu Yin, does that mean I would get a new population type? Because that'd be their people, wouldn't it? Oh, hello. A new leader. Fusha Keencrest. Is a guardian. Or... You know what, let's get this religious person. Hamharla Gerzi. Yeah, you were recruited. And I'm going to uh, manage you by assigning you to a system. Uh, the Viacris system, I guess. And let's give you some skills. You're all skilled up, buddy. Uh, born or far flung, I push your craver system. And uh, shelter city game theory, often interrupted by alarms, evacuations, and explosions. Tiring of constant disruptions, decision modeling, might do versus could do. Self defense force harass and drive off a major fleet. Alright. He likes to cause trouble. And he will. There we are. You improved a little bit more. There we go. Got lots of AI labor being built. Got more population. Oh, this is depleting quickly. Oh, I think... I think we're both at war with them. Yes. Three ships of Kadem. Let's take a look at the diplomacy set. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll show me what's going on. Um, so, let's swap position. To diplomacy from another person's perspective. Ah, so... Uh, I think this means he's at war? No. Cold War. He's at war with me. They're dead. He's got a cold war going on with these three factions. All right. And there's me. I have a truce. A cold war. A war, and I haven't met somebody. Okay. Well, that's good enough. That means I will be able to launch glorious invasions. Actually, let's take a peek. What are my options for glorious invasions? So you've got 150 manpower. Let's... This must be a colony. Ground battle. Okay. Well, we're, we're going to test this out. We're going to see how this all plays out. Take a look at the ground battle plane. Pain. Three choices. Strength and weaknesses. Okay. Quick incident your chance of success. So there's 30 enemy infantry. I could infiltrate. I can blitz, preemptively bomb. Mm. Or, okay, I think blitz, plus two rounds per turn. Minus one rounds per turn. Um, let's, this doesn't change my odds, but I would like to watch this battle. We'll try an infiltration. Ground battle. Bogmod versus Iron Fang. Whee! Look at them go! It's kind of neat, actually. A lot of shooting going on. Oh, no. Oh. Heavy death on the enemy side. 
There's a little holographic kind of representation sort of thing going on. But boy, is it going our way. And I think I'm about to win. Major victory. Okay. Well, let's... I believe I have other ships, don't I? No, I don't. Damn it! Alright, I'm going to take one last turn, because I demand... I demand to conquer this world first. I still have the edge on him, but though Kadem has tied me now. Let's trade. All right. Uh, well, first of all, uh, I will I will check the economy screen very soon. I assure you, my good friend. Let's finish the fight. Suppose war. Congratulations, the invasion was success. The system is now part of my empire. Unsurprisingly, it's not all that of roses. Native population isn't super happy, so it'll be in rebellion for a few turns. All right, cool. Well, let's take a look at this system, which is mine, I guess. Zuyin. It's in rebellion. No government. Automation policy. System representation none. All right. Well, I need to give it something to do, right? We'll settle it. And then I guess I'm going to go with um, uh, Xeno Industry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'll keep you busy for a while. Mm -hmm. uh, what else do I want to look at? I've also got. There we are! And the secrets. Actually, you know what? So I've conquered this. It's blue, it shows my colors, even though the, the this hasn't changed yet. We'll fix that next time. Um, but I think I'm going to take a break here. So thank you all for watching as the Sofans continue to rise ever higher into the world. Oh, taking first place now. Everything is coming up. Mm, Sofan. <laughs>